Witness Fatma Ghul Ilgaz. Your name and surname? Fatma Ghul You'll get well now. You will get well for me, Mustafa. I do love you. I'm waiting for you. I'll always wait for you. Mustafa told me that he had wanted to punish for all then. But he said he didn't. He said he didn't and that it was an accident. And he said he shot at Karem and that it wasn't an accident. I do love you. I'm waiting for you. I'll always wait for you. The witnesses' statements have proven that Viral Namli's death was an accident. He did not do it on purpose or with mal intent. And so therefore, I am demanding my client's release. Each of these witnesses have freely testified his innocence, where we can see that this was just an accident. I ask your honor that you understand that my client is not a murderer. With all respect, your honor. We heard the prosecutor and the witnesses. Now we will hear the accused. And so then, what have you to say? This is your chance to say what you want to. Do you have anything? I love Fatma Ghul very much. I do love her. That's all I can say. I apologize to her for all I've done. Forgive me, Fatma Gul. Forgive me, please. Listen now to the witnesses, the prosecutor, and the accused. Also, Karim Ilgaz has been acquitted, and we know that he shall be free of all charges here, where all charges against him will be permanently dropped, and certifying that he shall be cleared of all blame permanently. We know that Mustafa Nakali wounded Viral Namli, and he died because of him. And therefore, the court has sentenced him to imprisonment for 10 years and two months, and that will be served in full as of this day. And he tried to kill Karim Ilgaz, and he is sentenced to nine years. He kidnapped Fatma Ghul Ilgaz, and therefore the court decides to sentence him to due time, in prison up to three years in total, in the name of the law.
Aunt Margot. Please forgive me.